Dad, I'm late for school and I can't get in the bathroom. Well, join the queue, darling. Den, you're going to have to sort this out. Look, I talked to him yesterday, right? He reckons it's an habit he picked up in the nick, getting up early for his ablutions. Well, don't worry, he'll be gone in a couple of days. If he's not, I will be. Well, you don't think I'm any happier about this situation than you are? Well, get rid of him. You know, up until now, I thought Rolly was the only poodle around here. Hey, Dad, you can get in your old age or something. Why, what's that? Well, there's another bug tucked away upstairs, and he's even uglier than the last one. Sharon, box. walls have ears. That's all right. Pete knows all our business. Here, enough about the walls, if you don't mind, mate. It might be thick, not that thick. He'll be gone in a couple of hours. Hey, Peter, I have to spend the evening at your place with you. Yeah, sure, Twiggle. Use it like home for a moment, mate. Well, can you use Kelvin as chaperone? Yeah, and thanks for being so nice to Mum. Nice to her. I'll flatten her when I get hold of her. No, it's really sweet for you to book a proper holiday. She's gone along. How did you find out about that? I saw an envelope on the table and I opened it. Then goes my weekend with Jan. Come on, Miss Ann. Yes, it is on me. Oi, barman, set him up. Come on, darling. Keep going. I'm your best friend. Excuse me, Cam. What's your game, eh? What's you plan? You going at lunchtime and then come back till supper? Here, yeah. do you know that meal was cooked by Sue and Ali? It was smashing. I have a good mind to do a deal with them. They can cook the pub grub. Sod, Sue and Ali, where you been? That's what I want to know. Getting away from you and your blasted bank robber friends. Keep your noise down. Oh, what's the matter? Afraid the gorilla upstairs, my dear. He's already done it. You must know that. Shut your mouth before I shut it for you. Permanently. Oh, come on, what's all the shouting about? Oh, it's all right, darling. It's just Prince Charming here being his usual happy little self. Oh, come on, Dad, not in front of it's everyone. It's not me, it's her. She started out in the pub. That's why I brought her around here. Yeah, you're so masterful, aren't you? He's my hero. Mind you, you well bottled out with a lodger, didn't you? Yes, he knocked you down a peg or two, didn't he? <laughs> Have you looked at yourself lately? Look at that tatty old blouse. Oh, I'm going to stop them, Pete. They're destroying that the kid. Look, leave it, Kat. I know you feel, but leave it. We'll sort it out later, eh? Well, we can't all be like your precious Lady Muck, can we? So get naughty. Oh, stop it! Hello, young lovers. All right, are we? <laughs> what am I going to do? You've both been on a bit of strain the last couple of days, mate. Just what are you going to do about Sharon? That's more important. Sharon, what's she got to do with it? Everything, I should say. Everything. You and Angie still be tearing each other to pieces when you're 70, but it's not fair on Sharon, is it? I'm telling you, Jen, it's going to be a flurry of tacking powder and she'll be off on her bike and gone. Yeah, well, I've had about as much as a man can take in one day. No, he's not here. And don't ever call again. Listen, I'm not playing goose for you all night. Look, we have just invited you round to take the heat off things. He looks better to me, Mum and Dad. Oh, yeah. And what are you going to do when you want to warm things up? Well, I shall quite simply give my best mate the elbow when I... <laughs> you planning to use hand signals? Or have you got something more obvious in mind? Don't worry, you are going to be well off the premises by the time the fun starts. Mm. Mm, speaking of the devil. <laughs> Parents, I'm sick of them. Sick to death of them. Oh, I know exactly what you mean. I had enough around my dad this morning. Do you know, he's turning into a right impict husband. He even wears the apron to do the washing up now. Yeah, well, it's not me round with them so much. It's those two fighting all the time. I'm not going to put up with it any longer. Well, Shane, you could do worse than look for your real ones, you know. Oh, hang on. I don't want to fly in the nest just yet. No, no, I'm serious. In some ways, you're luckier than me and him. At least you've got another set somewhere if you want to trade this lot in. Yeah, I haven't seen what Kelvin's bought us. What's that? Oh, she's only a publican store, but she doesn't know booze from her bum. Bacardi, rum. Come on, let's have something that will loosen this up. No, thanks. I've seen what that stuff does to me mum. Oh, I'll come on in, Ian. It's me and you. Hey, you can't drink it if you want to be a chef. Well, what's that got to do with it? Well, it's like publicans, isn't it? The wine's always available when you want it. Yeah, um, I suppose Shannon's right. I ought to give it a miss. Oh, well, suit yourselves. All the more for me. <laughs> <laughs> 